IDX Broker offers an amazing lead management system. And in this video, I want to show you something very simple, but that some people are not aware of. And this is how to modify saved searches and saved properties for your existing leads and how to create new saved searches and saved properties for them. So I'm logged into a client's account here, and these are the leads on um, this account. I'm going to be using this one as an example because this lead has six saved searches. As you can see, some of these are auto-saved searches. So this account is using our auto-saved search application that automatically creates searches for leads that don't have saved searches. Um, and then this one was created by um, the owner of the website. So let's take this one as an example, auto save search number one, and you can click on view results. And this is what this lead is receiving updates on for this auto save search. So these are probably homes um, that match the criteria that this lead is looking for. And you have a button over here at the bottom that says add or edit saved searches. And this is where you would click on if you want to edit any of them. Since the auto save searches are created automatically, you can only edit the name and the URL, which I don't um, recommend modifying. And you can also click on here um, to deactivate updates. Right now, Rachel Singh is receiving updates. The ones that can be modified are the ones that were created using criteria. So for example, this one, if you click on edit saved search, this was a safe search created manually. It includes single family residential in these cities and it has a maximum price, bedrooms, bathrooms. Um, so this is criteria that Anna created. And you can modify this, you can add a minimum price. You can make sure that the properties are active, you can change this to a price reduction in the last seven days and then click on save changes if you want to save this um, modified saved search i'm not going to do that right now because this is a live account but this is how you would be modifying the save searches that are not auto save searches and if you want to add a save search for this lead you would click on here and you choose a search page so let's choose advanced search and we select the criteria for this saved search so i'm going to select a market area imagine that i want her to be receiving updates from this city um two plus bedrooms three plus bathrooms and active i'm going to be calling this test and I have this new safe search for Rachel Singh. These are the results of the homes. So let's go back to the leads and um, you can do the same thing for saved property. So for example, this lead, which is the test lead has one saved property, which is this one. You can also click on this button and um, you can edit this property. This is the listing number. You can give it a name, choose an MLS, click on save. And you can also add another property for Megan Realty Candy by adding the listing number, name, MLS, and click on save changes. All of this is available from your dashboard. So I'm logged into the broker's account or the client's account. And these are the leads that have gone onto their site. Um, also, it's important to mention that only this lead is verified. So if you want this lead to start receiving property updates, you would have to click on here and verify the lead. And they would be getting an email saying that an account has been created and it has been verified and they will start receiving updates.